Okay, this is a truly sad day for some of us that use Waves plugins. I own some Waves plugins and today I noticed that Waves have just dropped a subscription plan or subscription models and now the only way you can get waves plugins is through a subscription waves have just fumbled all their customer base by doing this i own some plugins from waves and what drew me to waves is the quality of the plugins and the fact that they have a lot of plugins and you were able to like buy them one by one. If you just want one plugin, you're able just to buy that one single plugin. But now you cannot do that anymore. Now all you just have to do is now subscribe and, and pay a monthly fee and now get everything, everything that you might not even use just for you to get maybe one plugin you want and you have to subscribe and now they have to take money from you every month. And I'm sure everyone is not happy about this. So they have this wave creative access that you have to download and then you can get access to all their plugins and this other thing. And I'm like, Waves, aren't you guys seeing what other companies are doing when they take this route and then learning from how people are reacting? So Waves creative access, they say create total freedom, the words, blah, 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 blah. All Waves plugins, all plugins included, new plugins added regularly. So you can choose between a monthly or an annual payment. And so they have two plans. So there is like a $14.99 one per month, which I think you get over 110 industry leading plugins, blah, blah, blah. <sighs> but you, you, you do have a trial, which is kind of cool. And then you also have the Waves Ultimate, which is like a $24.99 one. I think this is where you get all plugins, I guess. It says over 220 industry leading plugins. So that's what you get with this stuff. And it says all plugins includes updates, the world's largest, most diverse catalog of quality plugins, new plugins added regularly at no extra cost. So they're just trying to make you pay and all of that every month i mean dude come on bro the whole reason why we we loved wave especially for me i loved wave because you just buy one plugin and then you own it for life it's a perpetual license and you don't have to keep paying every month for that said plugin now if i want to update or if i want to get new plugins i now have to sign up and use this subscription service for me just to use a single plugin no one uses all waves plugins bro like no one does i don't care who you are even the big engineers and professionals i'm sure they don't use all waves plugins so this is actually not a good thing i'm, I'm really not happy about this and then they also say that two free months of splice so that's you also get two free months worth of splice. so i think they're trying to add something else just to add to this kind of subscription just to kind of entice you to subscribe i mean come on bro this is a bad idea. This is something that I think Waves should have at least looked around with other companies to see what other companies, the kind of reactions that they got from people, if the if people are a fan of these subscriptions to see what's good. And these companies need to come to the table and really explain to us why most of them are moving to these subscriptions instead of just sticking to, you know, the 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 buy a plug-in once model that they used to do and explain to us why they're moving to this subscription thing it was easier when you could just get the plug-in that you want when you want it and then you just use it and then you know you keep on adding plugins as you need them as you use them especially for companies like waves who have a lot of plugins and you cannot just buy all of them at once and get all of them at once now at the end of the year you end up seeing that you're spending more money than the value you're actually using because no one actually uses all of these plugins if you just need one plugin why can i just buy just one plugin you understand what i'm saying this is just a dick move from wave and everybody i'm sure is not happy about this no one is a fan of sign of money going out of your bank account every month every month they're just taking your money i think it's not a good move i think they're gonna get a lot of backlash from this online i'm sure it has already started but but for me this is just my reaction from noticing this as a person who owns some waves plugins and now knowing that i cannot get more Waves plugins if I don't sign up to the either the Waves Essential or the Waves Ultimate. Come on, Waves. You didn't have to do us like this. At least give us more options. Let us be able to buy them one by one. Or if you want to, if you want to just pay maybe monthly, then you can just pay monthly. If you want to just have everything and then pay monthly. Make it an option so that people can have all those kinds of things. And then they 
see what they can choose but if now you just make it a thing where it's either it's either this you subscribe to the subscription or no and you don't don't get our plugins it's just like pushing everybody to it and then people like us who own legacy plugins or bought waves plugins we can no longer get updates or even get the new plugins come on bro but i want to know what you think down below leave your comments down below what you think about this and what you think about the subscription models that these companies seem to be going towards and let me know what you think down below because this is crazy man but anyways i'm x and i'm out peace